Y'all probably say, where exactly are you going with this? I see you really trying to take it there. Old school flow, chew you out. Ain't fair, Jordan Pen. Alright, what's up, it's your boy Nilla Zai back at you. I said if you did 500 likes that I would do a second part to my workout video. Today is going to be all about legs. Probably three simple exercises, make maybe a little bit in between just to keep warmed up. But basically, I'm going to show you what we used to get down. As you see, the gumballs, don't mind them. Really, it's an exercise we call features. For a lot of people that have ever been broke off because they messed up, features is one of those things that's dominoes for the people that understand. And it's gonna be all for legs. It's a squat motion. Uh, and let me just get into it. Lay them all the way out. So we're gonna put one right here. Put one right here. Yeah, it might be elementary to some of you fools that have been doing workout for a long time. And we'll just put that, just that we'll put these on the side. Really, when you get broke off, you usually uh, do 13s, you know what I mean? But since we don't got dominoes and this is just something quick and Baldacci bumping in the background, look. So when you first start off, this is what you're gonna do. Down, pick it up. Go to the second one, put down, pick up, Pick up. Go to this one. Down. Down. Up. 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 And that's basically going to be the motion the whole time. Guarantee you. Don't look like much, but I guarantee you. Do 13. This is the closer. Bam. You can do wides, you can do cosins, you can do whatever. But the whole thing is to continue that motion. <sighs> Drop them once again. Boom, 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 boom. And all you're gonna do is repeat the same motion. Down, step forward, down. Pick them up, step to the next one. Down, down, down. Guarantee you, down, down, down. Up, 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 up. And that's basically how you do feet shots. Like I said, for a lot of people, they think it's easy. It don't matter how many times you did legs, whether you're expert in the proper squat position, you're a bodybuilder, whatever. As you can see, I'm old, so go to, go to any county jail, LA County, whatever, get broke off with features. I don't care how big you are, how strong you are, you're gonna feel that shit. And that's basically the first part of that. Right back at you. All right, it's your boy back. Anyways, I told you, you had to rest up on my old man, but anyway, you see my shooter hanging out the window. Baldacci pumping him up right now for the F. I'm not for the F, but you know, Baldacci for the F. Face of LA. But uh, like I said, this exercise right here, still the legs. You can do jog, you can jog in place, you can do knees to chest, whatever you need to do in order to keep that pump. Because after you do those feet toss, 13 dominoes. Guarantee you, your leg's gonna be burning. I've seen bite shots get broke off and pee blood just because the, the feet toss is the break off and waist side when you messed up. Either that or 250 burpees, whatever, you know what I mean? But basically, this next exercise is gonna be called rocking horses. The reason the raw walking horse is so so uh, strenuous, not strenuous, it's just they focus a lot on your leg and the up and down motion. A lot of people, look at, I will refrain from doing this if you have bad knees. If you have bad knees, don't do it because it will blow your knees out. But if you're young, you feel like you can get it or you got good knees, yeah, we have to get that in. Let me just switch this song with you. 
like this is why Dachi come get me. But anyways, like I said, this is the pump up when I work out. But this exercise is simple, but if you can't handle like the knee work, like I said, it might be a little hard on you. I tend not to do these, but it's basically like burpees. You can, burpees will blow your back out if you don't do them correctly, but I'm gonna show you how to do it. Quick little 25. Okay. So basically it's just like this. You wanna touch your toes if you're flexible. If not, look it, guaranteed hit the legs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 15, 5. A lot of people in that exercise, you know you always got the hard course. Like everybody know what I represent. Plain and simple, never been shy about it. Still on the turn up, but respectfully. Now if you heard me say 14 in the exercise, or four, understand, it's one of those things. If you've been somewhere and you know about it, we don't wolf behind gates, no disrespect. We're not blowing shit up in the exercise. You do that and you're gonna get smashed up. Plain and simple. I'm gonna do a little bit more, do a quick little 13 and then we'll go to the next exercise. But basically, get down, wipe out Dachi, pump me up, and my shooter in the window, you know what I'm saying? He ain't playing no game, you see the shirt? Anyways, get it. One, two, three, one, two, three, two, one, two, three, two, three, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, five, one, two, three, six, two, three, seven, Okay, this is a song called Detach. It's by P underscore O underscore P on SoundCloud. But you can find them as Proving Our Point all across IG. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, they be doing their own thing. But uh, check it out. It's hip hop. I had to change it up a little bit. But when I'm going to get into it, it's some mountain climbers, which a lot of you already know. Uh, yeah. And this is basically how you do them. Do a quick little 25 just to warm up. And then we're gonna go into the last exercise, which is stink bugs, because most people hate stink bugs. People thought it was a little, mm, you know, medio, whatever, but yeah. So I'm gonna get down in push up position. And basically, everybody knows what a mountain climber is, you know what I'm saying? And it's basically like this. You keep the foot out like this. This is what I used to do, you know what I'm saying? Aim a little bit like this, and just bring my stomach to my chest 25 times. You know what I'm saying? One, two, three, four, five, six. 8, And basically the reason I bend as much as I do Because I want to feel that crunch on the stomach What did it say last time? Somebody said something along the lines like I would never take advice on workout from a fat dude. You're right, out of shape as a motherfucker, but if you did what I did, got out, made it, and never went back, I would give you that, but you're basically a shadow. You know what I mean? I don't know who you are, I don't care. You wanna get your workout, prove me wrong. Show me something that uh, didn't take weights to do. Cause everything I had before, no weights. But yeah, so. I'm going to finish off with my last little thing. This is P-O-P, P underscore O underscore P, all caps. Signifying, proving our point. Let me just turn up just a little bit. You can keep going though. in the hood but you know we also got to keep it a little bit because people do work but basically sting bugs are this 
You're gonna go down like you're touching your toes. Like I said, you'll see after a while. That's why people usually do it up against the gate because they feel some type of way about it. But when you know, when you moving with real testosterone, you don't have to worry about that type of stuff. But it's like this. You're basically gonna wanna drop your back. And that's basically all you do. Them is called sting bugs. Like I said, we're gonna go ahead and cut it short. And that's like I said, I could have got more extensive into workout, but it's like somebody just told me, no matter what you put out about jail, people always want more. And I'm not trying to put it out there like it's something to be glorified. It's just something that I live through and still living through. Cause at the end of the day, I'm gonna tell you one thing. I'm still a slave to the cause. And it's just the way it is. But I still know the separation at the end of the day. It's like, take care of your family and leave that bullshit for when you got to deal with the bullshit and I ain't in prison and ain't nobody pushing a line on me you know at the end of the day like this no shout out no shot uh shots at anybody but an enemigo is always going to be an enemigo at the end of the day cool respected respectful but you know people are always going to feel some type of way about it and sometimes fools will push up on you but like i said for the cats that say yeah you know about fat i can still sling them dogs you guys enjoy the rest of your day that was a, a part of my little workout I could give you more if you wanted, but a lot of you already know the get down. So on that note, I'm your boy Neil Tazad. This is proving our point in the bag, but I thought she was on the other one. Shout out to Chief Loud. And I'm out. Oh yeah, and also follow us at K2 Zod and Ball Savvy for live reactions. A lot of you people been, uh, you know, you were on it, then you kind of start sleeping on it, but get back on it, let's get it. You know what I mean? That's live reaction. And uh, yeah, that's basically it. Shout out to Ball Dot. Kneel before Zod!